Hi, I'm Lindsay Baumgren of Nourish Move Love, and this is your 30 minute push workout. What does that mean? It is an upper body workout with cardio, and we're hitting our push muscles, which are your shoulders, chest, and triceps. So we're gonna hit those three muscle groups, and we're gonna add a little cardio push in there too. So all you need is some dumbbells. I have some 20 pounds and 12 pounds, because my 15 pounds broke on the way into the studio this morning, believe it or not. But we always say, use what you have. So whatever you have, make that work for you today, okay? Here's what your workout looks like. You have three circuits. Each circuit focuses on a specific muscle group, the chest, the shoulder, the tricep. Two strength exercises repeated three times because we really want to fatigue that muscle. And then we'll close it out and we're going to put in a cardio Tabata push. 20 seconds on, 10 seconds rest. You go hard for two moves, two sets, and we move on. All right, I'm going to walk you through each step along the way. Let's get our upper body warmed up so we can jump into this 30 minute push workout. Okay, let's go ahead and start with a warm up. Soft bend in the knees. We're just going to flap those wings. So just flap your arms. Core is turned on nice and tight. Opening up the chest, nice. Just starting to get some blood flow moving in those arms. Awesome job, you guys. I was just joking because I said, okay, we'll go ahead, we'll pedal back. We'll pedal back, open your chest. Someone messaged me that their son was standing in the mirror and he was like, hi, I'm Lindsay Pomegranate. <laughs> he thought my last name was Pomegranate, so I said, sweep to the front. I'm gonna open a workout video and say, hi, I'm Lindsay Pomegranate. So there you go. <laughs> That's your fun fact for the day. All right, and one more flap the wings. Awesome. Take your right hand for me, put your thumb out. You're gonna go thumb down, thumb up. Thumb down, thumb up. So it's like you're drawing a figure eight with your right hand, right? Core stays tight, right there. Thumb down, thumb up, nice. Just getting all that rotation in the shoulder, right? Rotating through that shoulder. We're gonna hit all heads of the shoulder, the chest, and the tricep today. Your push muscles, nice. Give me one more right there. Awesome, other side, right here. Thumb is up and thumb goes down and up. Go down and up. Just trying that figure eight. Make it big, big loops. Get all heads of the shoulder turned on right there. Awesome job. Nice work. Right here, down and up. Woo! Awesome, give me three, two, and one more. Finish it off, awesome. We're gonna go to the back of your mat and we're gonna do some plank walkouts. So you're gonna hinge forward. You're gonna walk out to a high plank position. Walk back in, nice work. Tap the toes, stand up and reach. Take it down. So we're warming up the core and the shoulders. Walk back in, nice work, stand up tall. This might actually be one of your cardio moves turned on later today too. We'll see what we get to. Awesome job, give me one more. And hold that plank walkout right here. Hold it here, nice. From here, you're gonna take a nice wide base with your feet, turn on your core, and give me shoulder taps. Opposite hand, opposite shoulder. Tap it up for eight, seven, six, you got it, five, four, three, two, and one. And because it feels good, you're gonna step your right foot outside your right hand, give me an easy twist, and then give me shoulder sweeps to the back, right here. Nice, give me three, two, and one. Switch it out, other side, left foot, outside, left hand. Easy twist, and give me those shoulder sweeps to the back, right there, nice. Right here for three, two, and one. Nice, replant the hand. Go ahead, give me two push-ups, knees or toes. Down, up, down, up, push back, down dog. That feels good. Little stretch, little pedal. Walk those hands back to the feet. Roll up one vertebra at a time. Let's get a little cardio burst in there. Give me some jumping jacks right here. Jacket, jacket, low impact, you tap and tap. You choose, there it is. Jacket or tap it right here for eight. Seven, six, you got it, five, four, three, high knees right here, let's go up, 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 up. You can step it or you can run it. You choose, you choose, get those knees up right here, eight, seven, six, you got it, five, four, three, two, let's skate, let's skate, side to side, push side to side. You can take out the jump, nice, just getting you to move laterally, awesome job, for eight, seven, six, you got it, five, Four, three, two, one. Let's just do some squat and reach. Down and up, down and up, nice. Push, nice, big overhead extension. Awesome, give me three, right here. Two and one. Woo, you warm? I know I am. Grab a quick sip of water. We're gonna jump into this workout. First circuit is chest, okay? So we're actually gonna start lying on our backside. I'm gonna have both my heavy weights and my lighter weights next to me. 
Okay, 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds between moves. Your first, first move is an alternating dumbbell chest press. So now if you have a bench or a stability ball, go ahead, grab that, bring it into play. I'm gonna do this from the ground. The bench or the stability ball is just gonna give you more range of motion. Start with my 20 pounds. Okay, back is flat on the ground, legs are bent at 90 degrees. It's an alternating press. So I'm gonna engage, so I'm lifting my arms off the ground, push one arm, push the other arm. So one arm is always under tension while the other one is pressing overhead, right? So that's move one. I'll show you move two as we go. But it's 40 seconds on, okay? 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off. Get it up, you're on. We'll push with the right in three, two, one. Here we go, so push right, down, push left, down. Now if you're laying on the ground like I am, you're not letting that other arm hit the ground. Nope, the back of my arm does not hit the ground. It stays under constant tension, right? You gotta hover that back of the arm just off the mat or the ground. Right there, hover it off, don't let it hit the ground. Keep that back turned on. Think about pulling your hip bones together. Keep that back engaged, right there. Ooh, do you feel your chest? Do you feel it working? Woo, I know I do. There it is. Yep, 10 seconds here, push down. These are feeling awfully heavy. Nice work, you guys. You got three, two, one. Take them down. I'm gonna switch out my weights. I'm gonna go a little bit lighter, okay, for the next set. The next set is a narrow chest press. So bring the weights to touch right here at my chest. Push up, open to chest fly. Bring it in, slow and control, lower down. Choose a weight that you can stick with. You're on. Ready? Three, two, let's go, let's go. Push. Open, close. So it's a narrow chest press. Gonna get a little bit more shoulder tricep involvement. Technically, my shoulders, chest, and triceps are all working in a lot of these moves. We're working all the push muscles. This first circuit is focusing on my chest, okay? Low back stays connected to the mat. Sloth, bend in the elbows as I open. Think about keeping the weights right in line with my nipples as I open, close. Chest stays puffed out. Right here, 10 seconds. Do you feel your chest? Holy bananas. This is gonna burn, you guys. This workout is gonna burn. I didn't think I was up for this. You're on for three, two, one. When I wrote this, I don't think I knew what was gonna happen. This is really gonna burn, okay? So we're gonna go back to those alternating chest press. We're doing this three times through. We're gonna burn out these muscles. You're on. In three, two, push with your right. Right, left. Keep that other arm up. Let's go, keep it up, come on. Yep, don't let it hit the ground. Hold these 20 pounds, yep, they're feeling it. Woo, I really wanna set that back of the arm down. Come on, stay with me, you got this. One rep at a time. Exhale, pushes up overhead. Exhale, pushes up overhead. Woo, these back-to-back -back movements, right? Three times through, that is what makes this workout really challenging. Yes, you can, you got this, push. Push, come on. Oh, it's really hard to keep that other arm balancing off the mat. I can do this, so can you. Come on, finish with me. 10 seconds, right here. You got this. Oh, it's getting hard. Three, two, one. Whew. I'm gonna have to go down and wait the next time through that. Whew. That is heavy strength training. Not a lot of rest between circuits, so we're working for muscle endurance. Sit it back, narrow push. Narrow chest press with the chest fly. Narrow chest press with the chest fly. Ooh, my shoulders and chest. You're on in three, two, let's go. So I push up overhead, open, close, lower back down. Maybe it's a good thing that I dropped one of my 15 pound dumbbells. They are so old, you guys, I need to replace them. They were so rusty that the head just broke right off the dumbbell. But right now, kind of think it's a blessing because these 12 pounds are feeling awfully heavy for this movement right here. Down, up, so my weights are touching on that narrow chest press, right? Down, up, open, close. Nice work, Whew, we are fatiguing the chest. Three rounds is no joke, you guys, it's no joke. Come on, you got five seconds here. Yes, you can. Stay in it, three, two, one. Take it down, I'm gonna stick with these 12 pounds. This chest is on fire for this last set, those alternating chest presses, right? Alternating chest press, one more time through. Alternating narrow press, chest fly. Finish these two exercises and then we're gonna go into a cardio push, okay? Alternating chest press in three, two, let's go. Push right, left, nice. Right and left. Keep that other arm turned on, right? There's constant tension. You gotta hold that weight right outside your shoulder. 
whole shoulders and chest. Nice work, you guys. Right here, come on, one at a time. These 12 pounds feel so heavy right now. This is your burnout round, right? Your burnout set. Woo! I feel it. Yes, I do. Come on, come on. Yes, you can. You are so strong. So strong. Push through this. Push through this. Come on, just press it up overhead. 10 seconds. Come on. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. I know it burns. I feel it. I feel it. Come on. Stay with me. Three, two, one. Holy bananas, you guys. Chest on fire. Three sets back to back with only a 20 second rest. That is something. All right, last set. Narrow chest press, chest fly. Narrow chest press, chest fly. Let's go, finish it, okay? And then you go up for a nice cardio push. You're gonna get to shake it out here. Stay with me. You're on in three, two, let's go. Narrow chest press, open, close. So we're hitting chest, shoulder, tricep, and then the chest on that chest fly, right? Soft bend in the elbows. Keep that back connected to the mat. Core stays turned on. I know it burns. I am so with you. This third set is just pure fire. Hello, muscular endurance training. This is a lot of reps, you guys, a lot of reps. Choose weights that you can stick with or start heavy and drop as you need to, right? Start heavy and drop as you need to. Come on, do your best, forget the rest. I'm feeling this, yes you can, 10 seconds. We're in this together, you guys. Nice, we're shaking it out for cardio in five, four, three, two, one more. Nice work, awesome job. Weights go up and over, off to the side. Cardio is all body weight and it's Tabata style. Okay, so we're gonna raise the heart rate. It looks like this. 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. Two moves, let me show you what you're doing. Your first move is a lateral, lateral Heisman runner. So I'm going to the right. Chop, chop, drive, chop, chop, drive, chop, chop, drive. It's like you're going between tires, drive and hold. That's move one. Move number two, oh, shoulders and chest. Down to the ground, four mountain climbers, one push up. So one, two, three, four, and a push up. <laughs> I gotta go to my knees. I was gonna attempt to do that from my toes. I think I might have face planted. My chest is on fire from those moves, you guys. Heisman runners. To your right, 20 seconds on. You're there, in three, two, let's go, let's go. Chop, chop, bound, chop, chop, bound. You gotta get started, right? Find your rhythm, chop, 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 chop. Find your rhythm, come on, 20 seconds. Yes, you can, come on, stick it. Stick that knee drive, chop, 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 come on. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice work. 10 seconds off, four climbers, one push up. Knees or toes, you decide. You could take it up to an incline if you have that option. Three, two, let's go. Climb for one, two, three, four. Give me the push up. Come on, one, two, three, four. Push up. Come on, four climbers, one push up. 20 seconds. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Woo! Stay with me. You got this. You're in it for three, two, and one. Shake it out, right back up. One more time, only doing cardio twice. It's a big push right here. We're gonna go to our left, chop, chop, bound in three, two, let's go, let's go. Chop, 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 chop. Tire, tire, up, tire, tire, up. Come on, 20 seconds, push that heart rate up. Let's go. This is your push day workout, your cardio push. It's gotta be a push, come on. Three, two, one. Last time, four climbers, one push up. If you have the capacity to take it from your, knee, your toes, do it. Three, two, let's go. One, two, three, four, give me the push up. Come on, one, two, three, four, push up. You got it, one, two, three, four, come on, it's only two rounds. Yes, you can, three, four, you're in it. Woo, five seconds, let's go. Come on, finish. Three, two, and one. Okay, before we go to shoulders, you're gonna take a quick stretch here. Okay, sit back, child's pose. Feels really good, right? Okay, put your thumbs up towards the ceiling. Extend your fingertips as far away from your body as you can. Opening up right here. This stretch is my favorite stretch before I do overhead press exercises. Why? Because it gives me greater range of motion and because I'm taking time to catch my breath. I'm just kidding. Okay, seriously though, that stretch, really good you guys, especially before you're gonna do an overhead movement. Moving on, shoulders, two exercises. Neutral press, 90 degree press, and then you're gonna go lat raises. I'm gonna use my 12s for this shoulder circuit. Okay, it looks like this. Neutral press, palms are in. 
Neutral press, up, open. 90 press, in, draw in. So I alternate a neutral press and a 90 press. I'll show you modifications along the way. You're doing it for 40 seconds. 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off. Neutral press in three, two, let's go. So press straight overhead, palms in, bring it down. Open to a 90 press, goal pulse up, down. Draw it in, neutral, goal post. Soft bend in the knees, right? If you find yourself arching through your low back, lessen your weights, drop down to a seated position or drop down to a kneeling position, okay? These weights start to feel heavy, alternate right here, alternate right here, draw in, alternate, alternate, okay? That's where I'm going. These 12 pounds, oh, they're mighty heavy. Bring it in, alternate, alternate. You're in the final three, two, one. Holy bananas, where are my 10 pounds? I didn't bring them today, I should have. Okay, Black grip, or lateral raises. Right here, palms are facing out. You're drawing up and down. I'm gonna go alternating. One here, one here. If you got heavier weights, do two at a time. You're on in three, two, let's go. So right arm up, right to shoulder height, palm stays facing out, right there, right? Alternating lat fly, alternating lat fly. Nice work, right there. Hello, shoulders. Woo. They are gonna feel this. Core stays turned on nice and tight. 40 seconds of work. You got lighter weights, you do double arm. Come on. This is burning, you guys. This workout, I had no idea what I was getting myself into. This is an intense upper body push workout. Yes, it is, but that's what we're here for. I have learned something about you guys, and that is you are stinking strong, and you are always up for a challenge. Three, two. One, roll it back. Set the dumbbell down, shake it out. Back to 90, right here. I'm gonna alternate, so I'm gonna go one right, one left, open, one right, one left. That's where I'm going, okay? Single it out with double arms if you have that capacity, right? I love it, here we go, you guys, right back into it. Woo, roll those shoulders down and back, get it up, you're on in three, two, let's go. So I go right, left, open, right, left, but you see that there's constant tension, right? Right, left, come on, open, right, left. Again, you can slow this down. This is tough stuff, you guys, push, push. That's why we call it a push workout, come on. Use that breath. Oh, I'm shaking, I'm fighting through this. Okay, I'm taking a quick break. Shake it out, you got 10 seconds, let's go. Jump into it, come on, 10 seconds. Stay with me, five. Four, three, two, one. Oh, holy bananas. Holy bananas, shoulders on fire. All right, lat raises. I'm gonna alternate them again, you guys. I'm gonna alternate them again. I love this. I love a good challenge and I know you do too. So let's do it together, okay? Grab those weights. We'll go left arm in three, two. Let's go, palm faces out. Stop bending the elbow, just right up to shoulder height. Slow and control on the way down. That's what's important, right? I'm not raising and then letting the weight fall down. That does me no good. I gotta control it on the way down. That's the eccentric motion, and a lot of the muscle building happens right there, right? That's where a lot of the muscle building is actually happening. Slower on the way down is harder and better. Keep that core turned on. Think about spreading that floor apart underneath you. Activate the glutes, activate the quads, activate the core. Nice work, you guys. Come on, 10 seconds here. You got it. You got it, you got it. Finish out circuit number two right here. Five, four, three, two, and one. Set them down. Circuit number three. It's gonna burn. It's gonna burn, right? You do your best. You need to take a time out. You set them down, count to three, and you get back in. Don't take longer breaks than three seconds, okay? That's my challenge to you. Pick them up. Neutral press, shoulder press. I'm gonna alternate my arms. You do you. We're in it. Let's go. Three, two, one, when you know it's gonna be hard and you know it's gonna burn, but you're gonna give me your best effort. That's what I want, right? Give me your best effort today. What does that look like for you? Someone said, I love how you just say do what you, where you're at. It's where you're at, you guys. You go back, you watch my videos from when I'm like four or five months postpartum. So different from where I am now, 14, 15 months postpartum, right? You do what you do, do what you're at. None of that made sense. Set my weights down, shake it out. You got 10 seconds left. What I meant to say is, come on, do your best with where you're at, right? Come on, five, four, three, two, and one. 
Nice work, you guys, set them down. Do your best with where you're at, okay? You are here to get better. That is what we're here for. Show up, work hard. I know you guys are hard workers, and I stinking love that about you. All right, last set, alternating right here, 40 seconds, and then we're gonna go back to another cardio push. Palms face out, shoulders down and back. Three, two, fly to your right. Right here, up and down, up and down. You control it, right? Nice work. If you've got to swing the weight up, it's too heavy for you. I know I encourage you to go heavy, but I also encourage really good form, right? Get the best of both worlds. Find that happy medium. Up and down. Nice work. Woo, shoulders. Shoulders on fire, and I love it. It means I'm going to be sore tomorrow. It means I'm going to see strength gains. Come back. Do this workout again. Continue to get better every time. 10 seconds. You're in it. Come on, let's go. Nice work, you guys. Stay with it. Three, two, and one. Set those dumbbells down. We go back to cardio, okay? Two moves, 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off, two times through. Your cardio moves look like this. Oh, a plank walkout, right? I'm gonna get these dumbbells out of the way so I got space. Walk out to plank, hinge forward. Walk out to plank, step or hop up, and then shuffle back, okay? Walk out, shuffle back really fast. Hop up, shuffle back. That's move one. Move two, good old punch jack. Punch it, jack it, punch it, jack it, punch it, jack it. All right, two moves, 20 seconds on, right? 10 seconds off, fast, furious, awesome. That's what it is. Walk out in three, two, let's go. Walk out, find that high plank, step or jump up, shuffle back. Here we go, walk out, come on. How fast can you get through this? Walk it out, jump or step, shuffle back. Let's go, 20 seconds, make it work. Come on, yes, 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 there it is. Nice work, you guys. Awesome job. Come on, you're in it for three, two, one. Woo! Punch and jack. Come on, punch and jack. One punch, one jack. Let's go, punch on the right. In three, two, let's go, let's go. Punch it, jack it, punch it, jack it, punch it, jack it. Up, up, there it is. Nice, push, right here, you could I punch. Tap, punch, tap, punch, tap. Choose your intensity for five, four, three, two, one. Woo, awesome job. Right back in, walk it out, jump up, shuffle back, last time. Three, two, let's go, walk out, jump up, shuffle back. Walk out, jump up, shuffle back. Come on, right here. 20 seconds, 20 seconds. Stay low on those legs. Keep working those shoulders on that walkout. Woo, you're in it. For three, two, one. Woo, one punch, one jack. Finish that cardio push. Raise that heart rate. Right here, on the left. On the left in three, two, let's go. Punch it, jack it, punch it. 20 seconds, let's go. You got it. Ha, ha, come on. Cardio, upper body, push. Woo, right here. Finish with me. You got three, two, one. Nice work, grab some water. Grab some water. Awesome job, you guys. Circuit number three, coming at you, triceps. All right, circuit three, let's do this triceps. I'm gonna grab a chair and bring this into play because we're gonna do some tricep dips and I like the range of motion that I get with a chair. If you don't have a chair, you could use a couch, a bench, or I'm gonna show you, you can do them from the ground too. You just get more range of motion if you can use a chair or a bench. Okay, triceps, I'm gonna use my 12 pounds. Skull crushers is move number one. You're on your beautiful backside, right? Lying down on the ground. Press that low back into the mat, okay? Activate the core and you're just bending and extending. So just at the elbows, 40 seconds of work. Right, 20 seconds of rest, okay? Skull crushers, and then we're gonna go into tricep dips. Those are your two moves. Grab the weights you wanna use for skull crushers, cause you're on. In three, two, let's go. So lowering the weights right down to the temples, pushing up, that's the side of my head. <sighs> nice work, right here. Down and press. Again, I'm not letting the weights fall down, I control them down, powerful press up. Control them down, powerful press up. For me, I really have to think about on this exercise, Activating my core, pulling my hip bones together, and pressing that back into the mat. Keeping a nice stable core, focusing just on the back of my arm, my tricep. 
right? If I was at home, I might, might reach for those 15 pounds. If I get some new ones, mine are broken. <laughs> All right, right here, come on, stay in it. You got five, four, three, two, and one. Nice work, you're gonna set the dumbbells off to the side. I'm gonna show you first how to do tricep dips on the ground, and then I'm gonna take it up to my chair. Fingertips are gonna face my butt, okay? Fingertips are gonna stay facing my butt. Shoulders are down and back, nice long neck. You're gonna lift your hips off the ground, bend your elbows back, and press up. You're on in three, two, let's go. So down, up, down, up, down, up. Think about shooting your elbows straight back towards that wall behind you. Bend, push, bend, push. Option A, stay here. You could even get greater range of motion if you put your hands on top of your dumbbells, if that feels comfortable for you. Your other option, right, is you're gonna come up to a chair, okay? I'm gonna come up to a chair right here. The closer my legs are, my back is gonna stay that close to here. Bend, push, bend, push. Keeping my back close to, this is where usually my mic pack falls off, right? Because it hits the back of my chair. Elbows go straight back behind me. Fingertips are still facing my butt. Three, two, one. You're out. Shake it out, okay? We're gonna repeat that. Woo, woo. Triceps are gonna get nice and fiery, you guys. This three sets, I was thinking, should I do three exercises, two sets, or two exercises, three sets? I'm glad I chose this because this is true fatigue, right? Down in your back, three, two, let's skull crush, so down and up. True fatigue, these two muscles, back to back to back, times three. That is whew, one way to really break down muscle tissue, right? This is intense. You're gonna feel this tomorrow, right? Push workout. Hoping to bring you guys a pull workout. Hitting the back and biceps similar to this soon. But I love this combination. Chest, shoulders, triceps. They're involved in all the muscles, all the strength exercises that we're doing right here. You're getting after it. Come on, 10 seconds. Yes, you can. Ooh, those triceps are fire. Come on, stay with me. Stay with me. You got three, two, and one. I love how I say, if I was at home, I'd be using my 15 pounds, and then I'm on set two, and I'm shaking with the 12 pounds. I'm like, no, okay, I'd actually be using my 12 pounds. Yep, that's where we're at. Okay, fingertips are gonna face my butt. Shoulders are down, out of my ears, nice long neck. Okay, the closer my feet are to the chair, the easier it is. The farther they go out, the harder it is. I'm gonna find a happy medium. You're on in three, two, let's go. Down, up, so I get more range of motion, you see, by using this chair. You could use a couch at home. Whew. This is gonna, I'm trying to find a pace I can stick with for 40 seconds. Again, I might have to take a break here. That's a quick tap out. I count to three and I get back in. That's what I'm doing, okay? Gotta take a break. Yes, you can. Woo! Stay in it, stay in it. Oh, it burns, I know. 40 seconds is a long stinking time to do dips, right? Quick tap out, quick stretch, 10 seconds, okay? Back in, here we go, finish with me. Woo, you got this. Yes, you can, right here. Five, four, three, Two, one, holy bananas. Woo, this workout, ha, that is fiery. Okay, you guys, last set. Last time you gotta do it on your backside. Last time, skull crushers. Last time, tricep dips. I love this, strength gains. You, I got, you guys, you're gonna get so strong. You guys are all gonna be so ripped. All right, on your back, three, two, let's go. Come on, skull crushers, last time through. Last time through. If the weights you have are too heavy, you could always take this down to one dumbbell, right? Hold it the long way, right here. One dumbbell, right? Okay? The goal is to keep working through these working sets, however you need to. This third set, it feels like a burnout set at the gym, right? Where I'd go lighter and just crush as many reps as I can, and I'm just shaking to fatigue. That's where I'm at right now. You got 10 seconds, come on, join me. 10 seconds to find that fatigue. Woo, it's there, it's there. Stay in it. Come on, three, two, one. Oh, I love it. Nice work, you guys. Awesome job. One more set of tricep dips, and then we got one more cardio push. One more set of tricep dips. All right, like I said, you gotta take a break. It's three seconds. Get yourself back in. Shoulders down and back. Nice long neck. We're gonna dip it, dip it. Those triceps are gonna burn. You ready? Three, two, let's do it. Let's make them burn, come on. You are so strong. Just keep telling yourself that last set. Yes, you can. Last set. Light at the end of the tunnel. Set number three. Come on. Woo, stay in it, stay in it. You got this. Down, up, down, up. Come on, come on. Yes. One rep at a time, that's what I'm telling myself. Come on, just get to the next rep. Just get to the next rep. You got it. Oh, quick break. 
Woo, that fire. Woo. Okay, back in. Let's go. 10 seconds. Let's finish it. Down up. Come on. Stay in it. Stay in it. Woo. Let's go. Give me five. Four. Three. Two. You got to give me one more. Oh. Oh. That is it, you guys. Woo. I love it. We are going to feel it tomorrow. Come on. Take those chairs or benches, whatever. Get them out of the way. Last set. Cardio. You with me? Two moves. 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. You do it twice, that's two minutes of work. So that's all that you got left. Two minutes of work, all right? Here's what it looks like. Oh, we're getting into the core, okay? Knee drive sit up right here. Punch, punch and crunch. That is move number one. Move number two, oh, it's a good old army crawl burpee. So I go down, down, up, up. If your tricep let you, hop in, jump at the top. Come on, two moves, two moves. 20 seconds of work. Yes, you can. Come on. All right, Woo. you ready? Lay it back. Sit up, punch and crunch in three, two. Let's go, sit up, punch and crunch. Woo. Punch and drive. Pull that knee in, opposite hand, okay? If you don't wanna give me a full sit up, right here, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Really good option right here. Boom, like I said, you do what you can do with what you got, where you're at. Let's go, finish with me. You got three. Two and one. Army crawl burpee. Army crawl burpee. 20 seconds. Take it down to the ground. Walk down to the forearms. Walk up. You're on in three, two. Let's go. Hop back or step back. Down, down, up, up. Jump in. Explode at the top if you can. If you can, right? You do what you can do today. Come on. Yes, you can. Halfway. Halfway there. 10 seconds. 10 seconds. Remember what arm you're leading with on that army crawl. You're going to switch it up. Second set. Give me three, two, one. Nice work, you guys. Nice work. Let's go, knee drive sit ups on your backside. Woo, three, two, let's go. Last set, last set. Come on. Last set right here. Last set. 20 seconds. Yes, you can. Finish this workout strong. Remember, this is called a push workout for a reason. It is meant to push you. Come on, come on. Let's go. Three, two, one. Woo! Last time, army crawl burpee. Army crawl burpee, the big finish. You ready? Turn up the volume, finish strong. Three, two, let's go. Leading with the other arm on that army crawl, okay? Dropping with the other forearm if you can. Come on, this is your big finish right here. This is it. Come on, what would it look like if I said 10 more seconds? 10 more seconds. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Come on, stay with me. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice work. Upper body, push. My chest, shoulders, triceps, they're jello, right? Woo. It is gonna be hard to push a stroller, push open a door, or do any of that business today. Woo, let's just flap our wings. Quick cool down, you guys. Quick cool down. As always, if you like this workout, do me a favor, hit subscribe on our YouTube channel so you get notified when we drop new workouts for you. Okay, we're gonna go for a good neck stretch because push muscles, our shoulders tend to come up into our ears. So think about relaxing, dropping your shoulder over to the left. Right here, left hand gently goes on top, pulls down. Now if you have the capacity, take your right hand, wrap it around your back, reaching for the middle of your back, palm faces away. This is gonna open up my traps right here and open up my neck. Nice. Gently release. Now give me a rock of the head. Rock it back and forth. There you go. Other side. Hold over to the right. Right hand gently rests on the head. Take that left hand if you can. Wrap it around the back. Palm faces out. Open up the chest, the shoulder right here. Should feel really good. Woo! Awesome job. I'm so proud of you. I hope you love this workout. It's so fun to split train some muscle groups, right? Really breaking down and digging into the chest, shoulders, triceps. Gently release, flap the wings. Reach up overhead. Right arm reaches for the middle of the back. Let's stretch that tricep because that felt fiery after those tricep dips, right? I'm gonna feel this workout tomorrow. And that's what I love. I love a workout that I can feel, right? I know I challenge myself, push myself. Can't do that every day. You can't come show up, lift heavy, go hard every day, right? You gotta make sure you include those rest days, those stretch days, so you can come back into these workouts really tough. 
Nice. Go ahead, flop your wings. We're gonna go ahead and take a nice chest expansion. So reach your hands behind your back, clasp them, and pull the knuckles away from your tailbone, opening up through the chest and the shoulders. If you feel good about your heart rate, go ahead, give me a forward fold. This falls down towards the ground, towards me. Nice. Gently release the hands down to the ground if it feels good. Plant your right hand on the ground, left arm high. Oh, roll out that wrist. Switch it out, other side, left arm down, right arm high, roll out that wrist. Awesome job, set it down. Roll up one vertebrae at a time and you get to the top. Two big shoulder rolls, up, back and down. Up, back and down. Awesome job, you guys. Thank you so much for joining for this cardio and upper body push workout. I hope you loved it. I hope you come back and do it again. I hope you hit subscribe and check out more workouts at nourishmovelove.com. Have an awesome day.